Hey guys, what is up? It is Ashley from Bookalogs Anonymous, and this is a February <clears throat> type book haul thing. I don't think I've done one for February yet, so we'll go with it and see. I might do more. I don't know. Who knows what kind of books I'll get in February. But, so we'll just start with the <clears throat> two that I actually bought myself. The first one being The Song of Achilles by Madeline Miller. <clears throat> this was a book that was recommended to me for my 12 books, 12 friends, 12 months challenge thing. And I think they said something about it making them cry, so I don't know. We shall see what this was like. There's the first one. <clears throat> and then the second thing I got is not technically, it's not like a reading book. It says Burn After Writing and then Sharon Jones and then more like prompts that you can write about. Um, like that. I don't know if you can see it. It just says how, how honest can you be when no one is watching? And like, I don't know. It just, yeah, it's they're just like little questions you answers. Um, like so, yeah. I don't know. We'll go with that. next few books <clears throat> are books that were gifted to me which I am so grateful for guys so yeah <clears throat> the first one I already opened because it's on my TBR to read for this month and that is A Moment of Truth by Casey West and this is the second to last book that she's written so far that I have that I needed to read so I'm excited to have it and to try to read it this month. I think the last book that I need from her is Sun Kissed. I think that's what it's called. I'm not sure. But. And there's that. I don't know if I did that. Anyways. The next two I haven't opened and I'm pretty sure I can probably guess what they are but A mess. So the Moment of Truth book was from Jessica <clears throat> in one of my reading wish list groups. So thank you, Jessica. I'll put that in my book so I remember. <laughs> the next one is a bit Bunnel King, and it is Miller. And I think this is the first book in the Kings of Denver series type thing so I'm all for the spicy stuff lately so but yeah and this one was from Kimberly so there's that one I don't know where I'm gonna place them but and this is the next one. I think I might know what it is, but then again, I don't know because I think one book that someone said they were going to send me was going to take a while. So, we'll see. This is definitely not one I was... 
yep, so the one that I'm thinking of is not coming for a while, but. Oh, that's awesome. So this one is from Chantel. And it's Reliving Fate by Natasha Preston. So I am all here for Natasha Preston books, as you guys know. I have one on my TBR for this month, and this one sounds... Fun. It just says, Reliving Fate, Murder, Guilt, obs Obsession. I'm definitely all for this, so I'm excited. So, yeah. Uh, those are all that I've gotten so far. But like I said, I know there's at least one more coming. I just don't know when. So, thanks guys. I will see you next time. Or maybe I just add on to this video. I don't know. <laughs> Bye for now. Hey guys, it's Ashley from Bacolics Anonymous. And this is another book haul in February which will just be attached on to my one I did before. So let's just get into it. The first couple are ones that were gifted to me and one of them I'm ecstatic about you guys. Like the person who gifted this to me, I appreciate it so much and you'll see why. <coughs> we'll look at those in the first one here. that was on my list doesn't say oh and it was from Brittany like I said these are gifts from my Facebook groups I'm in but this was the Grim Rose Girls it just says one murdered girl four troubled friends and a fate that can't escape like, that sounds amazing and I love the the cover <clears throat> and honestly, I just thought about this, but the book, some of the books that I bought um, yesterday are pretty much all like thriller mystery way. So yeah, I guess that's where my head is at right now. <clears throat> definitely not expecting <clears throat> and that was Heartbones by Colleen Hoover and this was from Elizabeth and the Control Wish List swap book so, so yeah thank you Elizabeth I will definitely be reading this because this was a book that was On my 12 challenge list, so there's that. The next one, guys, like I said, <clears throat> the next one. Oh my god, I'm so freaking excited! So, <clears throat> I have the first two Harry Potter books that are like illustrated by Mina Lima, and she has. She did one for Alice in Wonderland, you guys. And that was has been on my wish list forever. Someone finally got it for me. <clears throat> so, um, Jandy. And it just says, I wanted to spoil you a little. Hope you love it. Sending all the love from one Doxy Mama to another. So, and this was in one of our little games about um, who here has a Doxin? What's, um, what she sent and I answered it first I had a doxy and yeah I just you guys 
know my obsession with Alice in Wonderland. I mean, it's in plastic. I don't even want to open it. This just looks freaking amazing. It just says features, inclusive, exclusive 3D interactive elements, including a growing Alice, a disappearing Cheshire cat, a removable map of the looking glass world, and more. I cannot even with this book. <clears throat> okay. We're going to have to open it because I just to show you a little bit. I don't know. I might even do like a flip through of the whole book at some point. But I. Like, this was not cheap either, guys. This. It's amazing. I, don't, I didn't even want to open that. So here's the back. Oh, it's so soft. Oh my god. First interactive like uh, the first interactive thing. What is this? Okay. Like the first interactive thing is Alice. Her legs move. I can't even like yeah we'll definitely take a look through it I, at some point I think but <sighs> thank you Jerry. that's going in there <clears throat> for the books that I bought Because I went to Target with a friend and the, the books were buy two get one free. So. Yeah, it happened like that. Oh, I hate these stickers. So the first one I got was The Companion by Katie Allender because I adore her other books. This just sounded fun or interesting, scary, I don't know. So, ouch. There's that one. These other two I haven't even heard of. They just screamed thriller, mystery, YA, and I couldn't help it. So. First one is The Girl in the Headlights. Yes, that one came off so easy. By Hannah Jane. And it says, they say she did it. She doesn't remember. Next, the last one is Even If We Break. Marika Nijkamp. I probably said that wrong. It just says their story ends tonight. So I'm all for it. And yeah. That is what I've gotten this past week or so. So yeah, 
let me know if you've read any of them, what you thought. I will maybe see you guys before the end of the month. I don't know. Bye. For now. Hey guys, what's up? It's Ashley from Bookholics Anonymous, and this is kind of a little book haul. Some, oh, like, one, one or two books I got in March, and then the other two I got recently. So, yeah, that's all this is, for, just real quick, so. Because I can't remember if I did it. Um, the first one I got in March sometime was Jurassic Park from... It just says Liberty, it doesn't tell me. I don't know if I put this in or not. I don't think so. But, yeah. So, that. Um, the next one is from Rachel Buckley which was a birthday gift, which my birthday was in, on the 4th of April. So I really appreciate that. I wanted this one because it's actually becoming a movie. So, so I just wanted to read it before the movie came out, or before I watched the movie. So yeah, there's that one. If I said it. it was The Sky is Everywhere by J.T. Nelson. I don't think I said that. I don't know. And the next two are two that I purchased, which I'm really excited for. The first one is from. I was not sure. book. I've seen some good things and you know, and that is Ice Planet Barbarians. So basically it's alien romance. <laughs> so, yeah. The last one that I got was from Megan, or that I purchased. And that was an arc of the Extraordinaries by TJ Cook. So, yeah. Pretty excited for this one as well. So we'll see how it goes. Those are the couple of books that I received recently. So thank you for watching, and I might add on to it, I don't know.